All right, Dusty, time now for our prime match of the week involving a big but agile man by the name of the Man of Questions. Well, you talk about trick or treat. The moon match of the week, always the most important thing on WCW. And if I got a surprise for you, D, I've hired the goblin of all goblins, the Google goblin. I mean, I'm talking about goblin man himself. Get up here now, goblin. Get over here in the middle. And I, Now, listen this. This is the moon match. The fans are waiting for the big move every week. All the cowboy fans out there, the goblin, straighten up and fly right. Give me the move right out of your lip. That's pretty good, ain't it? This is prime cut. Yeah, but the problem is we still get a little bit more time to fill. So what okay, are we going to do? Come back here, goblin. Come back over here. All right, fans. As I promised. A double move for me and the goblin. One, two, three. All right, Dusty, as you uh, said, we are ready for the move match. Well, I'll tell you what, it's a really good new look at some new guy that calls himself the man of question. And right off the bat, I'll tell you one thing, I tapped him in the hall, he is big but very very weird but weird is a state of halloween havoc my friend of what's going on here with the dungeon of doom he looks like one of them guys that come out the dungeon of doom uh, in fact he, he looks like he'd fit right in there with a shark and kamala and zodiac he's the man of question because there is some question as to his sanity he'll be uh, laughing hysterically one moment there's barry houston and then the next moment uh, attacking his opponent viciously so it is our first look at the man of question See? See what he just did? Yes. This guy is nuts. He's a psycho. I'll tell you what, Barry Houston, go to give him a test, because Barry Houston, you know, can go. I guarantee you he's one of the, these young kids that are really trying hard and, and making improvement all the time. And uh, this guy here, we're going to see right now about the man in question, of question, if you will, in public, right here on WCW Prime Match. Getting ready for Halloween Havoc only on pay-per-view. Yes, don't miss it. Sunday, October 29th, never. Too soon to call your cable company. Don't get caught up in that last-minute rush of candy buying and costume buying and face painting. Get ready for Halloween Havoc, machine against machine. Who? Barry Houston with some shots to the uh, abdomen and nothing at all. Not going to happen. Now the whip on Houston. Wow. You are right, Dusty. This man of question is absolutely massive. When he is big and he took some blows there from Barry Houston and he really laid out some blows on Houston. He's got him really groggy right from the get-go right here. Doesn't seem to get in a hurry, really trying to take a hard cold look at him, but seems to know what he's doing, knows his way around, and uh, he's already made comments about the Macho Man Randy Savage. I mean, destroying destruction is what he wants to do. But the man of question is answering the question today. Can he do it? And we're seeing it right here against Barry Houston. Savage is going to have a tough enough time at Halloween Havoc against Kamala. Just play four, if yes. you will. And if he does get by Kamala and Lex Luger gets by Meng, then it will be Savage against Luger at Havoc, a snap mare. So Savage has got to face the challenge of Lex Luger and of this man of question. What gripe does the man of question have with Randy Savage? If people, I, they enter World Championship Wrestling and they see the big guns and they go for him, is that it? Well, it's an old, uh, we used to call it the, the new gunfighter would come into town. You know, and they would walk into Florida, wherever I was, and they would walk be a new young gunfighter, a new old gunfighter, thought he had a new game plan. And and from our history of life, if men are tested, when you're on top, you are tested by people that want to get to that plateau. And that might be the question that the man will answer, the man a question that is, questions to be answered later on by the man of question. Is that right? I have no idea. Oh, man! As big as he is, a spinning reverse kick. As if he were not a big enough threat before, this kook, this nutcase, has done a spinning reverse kick and has stunned this crowd. Well, very agile. We see that. We see the strength. See the power. See the movement. Very agile. And and uh, I tell you what, uh, very impressive right here on, on WCW Prime. Very impressive. I gotta tell you, Dusty. A lot of folks, as we look around, are still saying, "Did we just see what we just saw?" Well, if they didn't, they heard it because you done talked about it three or four different times, and and you need to get off of it and go on to something else. I it mean, was... we all seen it, we all heard it, we all saw it. 
Let's see it on slow motion instant replay right now. No, please don't give me that. If whatever the outcome of this thing is, Barry Houston could roll this guy up in a minute. Then we'll see it. Now the whip on Houston, who is essentially acting as a punching bag. You know, you started the match off saying how much Houston has improved, but I guess this is going to be one of those matches where all he does is learn. Yeah, you, you say that, you know, because he, see, he, he has no power in his punches. This guy, well, a little bit right there. He needs to really crank up. Can't get no offense going. Can't get no offense going. Now the reversal of the whip. Oh, man. The BL out of the corner, the high hip lock takeover. There you go. Now he's coming. There you go, Barry. Look at the thickness of the man of question. A right there that rocks Barry Houston. Now the man of question with a whip on Houston. Oh, a high press slam. Houston about 230 pounds. Very powerful. Wow. What power this guy's got. I yes, he it, yes, yes, he does. Yes, Green. he does. Green. He has a lot of power. Did you see that kick he did a while ago? Wow. And look, look at this right here, Chris. You know I agree with everything you say. Look out. I am stunned. What perfect execution Whoops. on that move. The move in a uh, whip and kind of a loop in the form almost of a question mark. Yeah, when you're almost 300 pounds, I was 300 pounds, and you do something like that, that is impressive. <laughs> and he, what? <laughs> what? What is it, boy? Speak up! I'm going to guarantee you one thing, he has to be reckoned with, and the Macho Man Randy Savage, if he's watching this thing, and I'm sure he watches it all, but this plate is full, this guy looks good. Just ask, what's the question? If there has to be an interview conducted with this guy, I'm getting nowhere near him. That's your task. Let's take a look at it again, Dusty. Well, right here you see the man in question has answered a lot of questions for us right here on the prime. Can he do it? Can he step up through the plate? Or is he all talk? He is so big, so agile. Great movement, great lateral movement. And right here you see him flying like the flying Belinda. Hooks him up, gets a one, two, three. Right here on WCW. Prime Christopher. Well, a week it's been, and coming up in a moment, we'll have word about next week and more about Halloween Havoc. Don't go away.